Let us pray. Our Father, in Jesus' name, we come to thank you for this meeting that you have called on tonight. We ask, O oh God, that your peace will reign in this place, and that, God, those that are here on behalf of the people and on behalf of the state, that they will hear you and your decisions, that we will have a peaceable time in this city. And, God, we thank you for all that you're going to do between church and state. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Thank you, Pastor. Council President, in accordance with the New Jersey Open Public Meetings Act, this meeting has been announced in all the property way, proper ways in accordance with the statute. Roll call for those council members present. Amador? Here. Baraka? Present. Trump? Present. Gonzalez? Present. Quintana? Here. <clears throat> Bryce Saxon Sharif? Here. President Ramos. Here. Uh, Mr. Clerk. Yes, sir. Uh, as you know, we have a vacancy on the North Municipal Council as a result of the resignation of the Honorable Donald M. Payne, Jr. This past Friday, the clerk informed us via memorandum that November 16th was the first day of the 30-day period in which a, uh, someone uh, may be appointed to fill that vacancy. I am now opening up the floor for nominations by the council to fill the vacancy. Council President, Mr. President, President can I uh, uh, Councilman say Gonzalez, I said we, have a, first. we have a said, motion on the floor. First. Wait a minute, he didn't I'm have recognizing a, Councilman Gonzalez. But he didn't have a motion. I said something first. Are you, is that how we're doing this? I heard him. You heard him you first? Heard him yes. First. I said something first though. Councilman Gonzalez. I nominate. Wait a minute, hold time. We can't do that. No. That's not, not how that's that, going to happen. Mr. Clerk. We Mr. can't do Clerk, that. How can we not going to do that? Move for re we, uh, we can't uh, do that. Change order of business. Clerk, I, I am chairing the this meeting is, and I recognize I don't care Councilman who's Gonzalez. Chairing the meeting. Councilman Gonzalez. He did not ask. Wait a minute, it, but wait, I, I, I asked minute. first. I spoke right, up Council. first. Everybody saw that. Nominate Shanique Davis Spike. Second. Councilman. Councilman Kevin is second. Second. Mr. Clark, uh, Mr. Councilman, Clark. Councilman, we have a motion Mr. on the Clark. floor yes. by Councilman Gonzalez. Uh, we're, 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 we're not going to. We're not going to let this go down like this. Uh, this, this, is is the, this is the. That's not happening. We have a motion on the floor by Councilman yes. Gonzalez, second by Councilman Amador. Respect. Roll call. And Mr. Clark, not only you, you did not. Did not. Stop that nonsense. So you, you did not. And Nobody moved for a second. I spoke first. You know second. I spoke first. Councilor Roll Call. Roll Call is a roll call. Take the roll call. What? What is going on here? Yes. Baraka absent. Trump absent. Gonzalez. Sharif absent, President Ramos. Yes. Four. No. Do you see the mayor coming up here? It's finished. Y'all finished? Are you finished? Is that finished? That's not finished? The roll call is done, right? Is it done? Council President. Council President. Ms. Councilman Sharif, we're in the middle of a no, roll call. I know I can do I'll show, this. I'll show you. I'll, I'll recognize you when you sit I back down. I can do here. this, and I will do this. <laughs> and not a police officer in this place will put a hand on me. 
I can do this. This is the most shameful day for this entire municipal council. This entire, we've afforded each other liberties and now we're gonna run this game? We just got off, a, we just got off an election, a national election, where we talked about voter suppression and the other side. And if this isn't the, if this isn't the height of exactly what we fought against, we all ought to be ashamed. We all ought to be ashamed. And this is a day, and I don't use this term lightly, that will live in infamy. That will live in infamy. And so I'm asking my council colleagues that I've worked with for two and a half years to reconsider what you're about to do. Because this is not representative of democracy. It is not representative. And if some people are so desperate, so desperate to push something through, then let everybody know, and I hope this is recorded, all of Newark's eyes on what you're about to do. And the blood will be on all of your hands after you do what you do. Uh, yeah. Mr. Clerk. Mr. Right. Mr. Clerk, a point, of, a point of procedure. Whenever there is a change in the order of business, the correct way to do it is to request a motion to change the order of business. That's how our council meetings are run through. Uh, and Bob, you're on the phone. That's how it's done. This is the first time in the history of this council that I know that people who are so desperate to gain power have, have decided to mutilate and to off alter the order of business. All we ask, all, and I know we're not getting it, but, but at least we can ask for some respect. I mean, we have helped some of you some of the time. Obviously, it means nothing. What you are doing right now is dividing this city at, by, along racial lines and along uh, the lines that, that, that demark how we do business with one another. So the blood is on your hands and shame on you for wanting shame on you for having to do this. If you had said something uh, out of the camera's eye, it would have been different. But guess what? I'm going to say this, 2014 is coming. 2014 is coming. And you may think, and you may think that you can win. And you may be able to carry the north. And you may be able to carry the east. But you cannot and will not carry the west, the south, and the central. Shame on you. Um, I just want to address the city clerk. Um, when we leave, there's no quorum here, so I don't know how a meeting is taking place. That's number one. Number two, everybody in this council chamber heard me, uh, raise, saw me raise my hand and heard me say, uh, council president, before anybody. Y'all should, should have had that planned a little better that somebody jumped right in and say that. But I said something, and you deliberately did not recognize me, and I think that that is completely and totally unfair. It doesn't matter if we agree or disagree. Listen, it doesn't matter if we agree or disagree, but you cannot obstruct democracy in the process of doing this. You cannot obstruct democracy. I have a right to disagree, and I have a right to what, what I am. What I am shocked about is because I see uh, our illustrious mayor over there, um, and I have never seen him at a council meeting since I uh, came here, and I, I actually started to, to, to to appreciate the guy after the storm, because I thought he did a good job. Um, but um, uh, when, when we hear talking about the MUA, he's not here. When we hear talking about uh, 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 issues that's pertinent to our community and city, I don't see him here. But I'm starting to believe that all of you guys had a plan for this to take place today. I hope that I'm wrong, but it seems a bit sinister what's going on in here today. It seems a bit sinister. Right. So I. That uh, is a problem for me, and I'm going to tell you this. I have something on the agenda tonight that I need to be voted on, but I will walk out of here tonight 
and not vote on it if you guys think you're going to destroy this town and obstruct democracy this way in here today and, and, and divide our city the way it's being divided. Since we sent Do you want to speak? Oh, you want to be? Order. <laughs> Councilwoman. <laughs> Whenever you want. Like. You voted. And so, Go ahead, Mr. And Mr. So, Council President. No, I'm not Mayor. finished talking, Mayor. Councilwoman, you're out of I'm order. I'm not going. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. You need to come up here and speak. I'm not. I'm on a. No, you can't, I'm a Mayor. citizen you first. Can't, Mayor. Order. I'm a citizen. I'm ahead, a Mayor. citizen right. first. Mr. Council President, in a, according a to the statutes of the state of New Jersey, I'm a citizen when there's a lack first. of a quorum. The mayor has a statutory opportunity and obligation to sit in to complete a, a, a quorum. And I'm here to preserve that role right now. Mr. Morasco. So I, I, Mr. Morasco. There's a quorum. I'm here. So, right. He can't take over the council meeting. He can't let him take over the council meeting because he has a plan. He cannot. He cannot take over the council meeting. I, I, again, I, Mr. Council President, I have the obligation. Uh, take the ob over the, the obligation council meeting. to cast a vote. I cast my vote Not for the council state. president. Wait a minute. He can't cast, cast a vote. Council president. Yes, no. We have no. Council president. No. Council president. No. Can't do that. No. No, he can't do it. Can't do it. I mean, this man don't come here for anything else. This is the most underhanded thing that you let this mayor do. A mayor that goes all around this country and talks about democracy, and you sit here, Councilman uh, Gonzalez, Councilman Gonzalez. And you allow this to happen. This is incredible. I cannot believe this. Council President. No. Yes. That don't, that's not how it works. What? And we and we depended on this clerk, this it clerk, is. to advise us. The Council President. What? I've been given a statute. By the Corporation Council? No, no way. No. No way. Uh, may I read the statute? Yes. You can, Mr. Clerk. May I read the statute? 40A colon 9-132. In every municipality, unless otherwise provided by law, if the governing body sh shall fail to organize and elect the president or chairman at its annual meeting <laughs> be to fill any vacancy in office or position, C, to adopt any resolution or ordinance, or D, to take any other action whatsoever by reason of a tie or insufficient vote There's among no the members. The mayor no shall tie. vote. In aid oh. of said organization, Not the true. election of candidates, Proceed. appointment of officers or others, adoption of resolutions or ordinances, or the taking of any other action. That does not apply to municipal government. You never said it once. You said corporations, organizations. I did not. I said in every municipality. No, I'm where, talking about in the where is um, Council President? I'm borrow my glasses. The, the clerk said that he got that from Corporation Council. Where is Corporation Council? 
I want to see Corporation Mr. Council Mr. right now. Mr. Who Clerk. are they? Mr. Clerk. So they hand off something to you, and now you're a lawyer? Mr. Clerk. No. I read a statement into the record. We opened up for nominations. And I've made Council a statement. Council Member Collins, you didn't recognize his hand. me. That's who I saw and recognized as the chairman. You didn't recognize me, though. You didn't recognize him. It was seconded. Him. We had a roll call, and the mayor cast the fifth vote. The mayor oh, does ridiculous. not have the right to cast the fifth vote. So, Mr. Clark, could I, could I have Ms. Bates come up? Are you kidding me? Are you? Are you? You know what? Shame on uh, Shaniqua Spate. She's being used by the mayor and by Steve Arbottom. Wait a minute. And guess you what? You told her to come up here? And get, you can't let her come up here. Mr. Clark. Oh, they can't come up here, bruh. What are y'all doing? They're, they're, she's is not this, is, what, is this what's happening around here? She's not sitting in that seat. Are y'all serious? You can't be serious. This is like the Twilight Zone up here, man. They voted. They four and the mayor is five. Mr. Clerk, yes, do direct me on the record. You need me to come up there. Thank you. 